I'm Diana Steele and I'm here at Fresh Street Market in West Vancouver. Today talking about some of the 2016 food trends you're going to see in the grocery store. Watch for words on packaging like ethical, sustainable, recyclable packaging, local, organic and fresh. Fresh is one of the big things. In fact, there's technology available now that will allow grocers to tell you how fresh your food is. How long did it take for this apple to get from farm to grocery store? And there will actually be measurable information so that might differentiate certain grocery stores apart from others so watch for that in the coming years another thing other than the fresh a trendy food is the vegetable who would have thought vegetables would become trendy but not just in their typical way eating more leafy greens but you're going to find vegetables in all kinds of different foods like added to teas or added to your yogurt so watch for vegetables in other foods another very trendy food is the mushroom whether it's portobello mushrooms or all of these beautiful types of mushrooms, not only are they versatile and they're a vegetable, so they go with that trend, but the umami flavor, and it's even um, sort of trendy to go foraging for mushrooms in the forest uh, when they're in season. So um, mushrooms, a big year for them this year. Full fat. They say by 2030, our fat intake is going to increase by 43% from where it is right now. So going for full fat yogurts, creamy, um, delicious butter and full fat meats even. That's where the consumers are saying the trends are going. Um, another thing is the grab and go beverage that has some sort of functional purpose. So whether it's kombucha tea or it's some sort of pressed juice and the movement of pressed juices is really taking hold. It's a, a full on group of people that rely on these on a daily basis and will pay, spend up to about $10 or more for just a single serving of a pressed juice that is not pasteurized. So it's very fresh. It's using vegetables and fruit and often added ingredients like turmeric or a, a certain type of protein. Plant proteins are also very trendy in 2016. Um, pea proteins, such inchi proteins, and even cricket proteins. Yes, bugs added to uh, energy bars. So not in this Vega one, but there is the, plant, the pea protein added to this one. So watch for different types of plant proteins that are sustainable and unique um, coming forward in 2016 for all of your um, energy bar needs. And then finally, probiotics. You're going to see a lot of probiotics, but strain specifics. So they'll start to identify certain strains that are good for a, a particular purpose and be able to indicate that. So lots of different things to look for. Grocery stores also becoming a little bit smaller. Um, gone are the hypermarkets and, and a little bit more custom. Lots of fresh ingredients really trying to bring in the consumer and marketing to certain people to show them that they have quality and they're really catering to their needs. So different types of food sampling um, that are going to be catering to your needs. So the grocery stores are following suit. Interesting. Thanks, Diana. Well, if you have any nutrition questions, you can contact Diana at 604-739-3290 or check out her website, eatingforenergy.com. You can also follow Diana on Twitter at eatingforenergy.